Marcio's plan is long-term. He recognizes that it's imperative that the next generation are taught about the importance of conservation. The Mamirawa Floating School visits the villages in the reserve. Today, the teachers are putting on a play about the protection of one of the Amazon's most unusual species, the manatee. The children also learn about the local habitat of the flooded forest. The play was about manatees, to encourage people like the fishermen not to kill them. And there was a phrase, and the phrase was, eat fish, but don't eat manatee. It's important because if people go on killing them, they will disappear. They won't show up again, and there won't be any more manatees because they won't come back. The Mamirawa Reserve is a partnership with the forest people. Therefore, their support and active participation is vital for its success. The town has been very lucky and has gained a lot from the Mamirawa Reserve. It's been a partner and it's been a good partner, a partner that has brought only benefits for the community's inhabitants. Marcio's work in Mamirawa has been miraculous. The reserve is widely recognized as one of the most successful efforts anywhere in the world at reconciling biodiversity conservation with human needs. Now he is turning his attention to his next project. This system that we worked in this reserve of Mamirawa has been so successful in this region that we created a second reserve, which is twice as big as Mamirawa, and now we want to implement. It's the largest protected area in the Amazon. It's called Amanã. Amanã links the Jaú National Park with Mamirawa Reserve, and that makes the largest continuous block of protected rainforest in the world. The creation of the Amana Reserve establishes a new vision in conservation. The enormous size of the combined area of the reserves ensures the protection not only of indigenous species, but also of entire evolutionary and ecological processes. Luis Claudio Marigo has traveled all over the world photographing wildlife. The Amana Reserve is a firm favorite. You can fly over Amana for for two hours without seeing one sign of human beings. Only nature, water, trees, and macaws flying over the forest. It's an amazing aesthetic experience. It's one of the most isolated, most wild places in the world. And because of conservation, you feel you are in a place without any uh, human interference. It's a powerful place because it's Primeval is uh, as it was made in the beginning of the world, as God made it if you are religious, or as evolution made it if you are a scientist. The Amana Reserve is in its infancy, and obtaining funding at this stage is critical. However, Marcio's efforts have been recognized abroad, and he has just been presented with a Rolex Award for Enterprise. The finances that this brings will be vital in advancing the project. The Rolex Award for Amana it's extremely helpful at this moment because it's a fund that's going to go to help uh, the scientific research and a little bit the social construction of Amanã for making a better management plan. 
The final leg of Marcio's trip took him to the principal village in Amana. They have seen the benefits of Mamirawa and understand what an enormous difference Marcio's work will make to their livelihoods. The important thing that Marcio did in the community, the project, was to create this reserve together with the community. We kept asking him because we knew Mamirawa was a reserve and it was working, whereas we were being invaded by the big fishermen coming from outside the region, by the foresters who take out the timber and by the hunters. We wanted that reserve, otherwise there would come a time when nobody would have the means to live here. We would have to leave for the city. That's why we were celebrating today, because of this victory we have achieved with him. Due to the severity of his illness, it looked like Marcio may never be returning to the forest. Now he's back, and the villagers of Amana are showing their heartfelt gratitude to the man who holds the key to their future. The community, I, Raimundinho, its leaders, we thought we'd prepare something. Some posters and these posters say lots of things. This one. Welcome, Dr. Márcio. God has cured the ill and God can cure you. Another. Dr. Márcio, your victories are our victories. Thank you for the Mamirawa and Amana reserves. Folks, I can't even stand up. I thank you from all my heart. The only thing I can say is thank you very much. This encourages me to continue not only with the fight I am now involved in because of my health, but also in the fight I got in involved in for you. We have achieved so many victories, both locally and internationally, that this work in which everyone is involved, the work of defending this area and creating a fairer society will be continued for a very long time. And the only thing I tell you is that it moves me to see that our work is obviously recognized. And I thank you from my heart for your prayers for us. Thank you very much. So now what I expect for the future is more abundance for everything. Game, fish, timber, all that. We'll have a more peaceful life and we won't have to leave this place for the city. Much of the Amazon remains at risk. But in Mamirawa and Amana, the destruction and exploitation have stopped. Marcio's groundbreaking work will ensure the long-term protection of the Amazon's ecosystem and its indigenous people. There were some times when I was in hospital that I thought, well, my work would be finished. And now, after six months, I come back here and I can see all the work is going on and that's a very great thing for me because this system is working. Marshall is succeeding in setting new standards for the conservation of the Amazon. He created new models for conservation and he proved it. He tested it and they work. Without Marshall, the Amazon would, be, would become islands of national parks. With Marcio, great parts of the Amazon are being conserved because of his concept of ecological corridors. I think Marcio is the, the guardian of the Amazon. I am very sure that the work in Amana is going to succeed. We are going to be able to replicate the model of Mamirawa and do a great contribution for the Amazon.